Okay, good afternoon everyone. I hope you are out there. Ha, if you are out there, let me know where you're watching from. My name is Valerie and I'm here again. A lovely Tuesday as you can see already. And yeah, 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 yeah. So how was your celebration? Let me know if you are watching me. And you can of course drop your comments out there. Hopefully, I'll be able to attend to some questions today. Yes. Okay, so I am here at our studio located at Ogba and I'm hoping that I can do something for you today. I want to take you on what we call the smoky eye. The smoky eye look. Yes. And I'm trying my best to make sure I do not waste too much data. I'll quickly reintroduce myself. My name is Valerie. Valerie from CC Valissimo Makeup Studio. And if you're out there, let me know you're out there. How was your celebration? What did you do for your celebration? I hope you enjoyed yourself. I personally enjoyed myself. All the days I was out somewhere. <laughs> Partying with people you know just having a very lovely time out there okay so today like i said i'll be working on the smoky eye look i have already created the look on one of the eyes right now and i am going to the second one and i thought yeah why not share share with somebody out there okay so yes we are sharing and we are sharing life now what i've done here is what i want to replicate on this side and probably improve the look so please feel free to ask any questions um questions will appear here yeah i would like to see your questions i would like to see your um the topic we're working on today is called the smoky eye look mm -hmm. and already i have added my um foundation on one end and i didn't make it very heavy today it's very light um i don't need to have it extremely heavy <laughs> make this hair no wahala meo are doing you're welcome to today's edition yes i like all your loves and your likes please put them out there i am willing able and ready to see all your likes and comments so I am filling in right now my eyebrow space. Okay, you're gonna forgive me. I'll be using my mirror so that I can see properly. So at some point I'll be raising up my head up to just see what I'm doing. Uh Timmy Tokwe, you're welcome. Thank you for watching. Thank you for joining me. I'm promising to make sure this one is as short as possible. Some people say, ah this your something it's very nice so it's just that my daughter used to finish Docas, you're welcome you're welcome say where you're coming from say yeah, where you're watching from like i said let me quickly go into today's class i am working on a smoky eye look i've already created the look here somebody's watching from germany kemi ah olasunji i want to say me germany one love we love him bye my worry okay so going on um quickly what I want to do now is my cleanup. I have already created the look on the eyebrow. Now I need to make sure the eyebrow is as small as the second one I have already done. Pro concealer. Okay, that's what I'm using. So what I'm doing is going under the eyebrow and shading it. I hope your weekend was lovely. It was a very long weekend actually for everybody. Hey, how are you darling? You're welcome. A very long weekend, yes. Okay. So, this basically just helps you clean up the under of the eyebrow so that it is... Please come closer. Hmm. Don't let me go and fall from my chair. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll be coming close into the into the camera so that you can see properly what i'm doing okay i made this one pretty light although i never like light eyebrows 
um, it's kind of in vogue a lot of people like light eyebrows I don't like it so I hardly ever make my eyebrows light but you can shade it as much as you want as heavy or as light as you want you are as free as possible okay this upper side there's usually a lot of controversy as to which of the eye shades to put for the cleanup I sometimes interchange I can use my foundation color or I can use my pro concealer oh Binga Binga is watching thank you darling thanks for watching me this morning I love you you know I love you now yes Binga is my husband and yeah he's watching anytime I see that mama I just go tun 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 <laughs> sorry sorry <laughs> okay so going on mm -hmm. I quickly go like that clean it up make sure it looks good on the upper section and on the lower section as well I clean up and make sure it is as perfect as possible one love my docas thank you so much thank you thank you thank you thank you to docas i want today's class to be as lively as possible what did you do for the weekend me i was just okay sorry let me let me turn it down easily i'm not going to turn it down what did you do for the weekend what did you do tell me tell me tell me how many of you went to the beach how many of you went to suya joint how many of you what did you do now let us know let us know okay and i hope you're gonna crush this week i'm gonna i hope you're gonna make this week as productive as possible and it depends on what you do right now it depends on what you're doing today what you do today will make the week a lovely one or a dull one or a, an amazing one anyway, anyway going on <laughs> i've done that now i go into my transition color okay i want to use my one of my foundations it's actually not a foundation it's a one of these your powders but it's slightly darker than my shade so i'm going to just use it as my transition color so i come into the shadow space into my eyeshadow space just swipe it swipe it swipe it make sure i'm going close to my eyebrow close to that cleanup i have done already swipe that swipe that swipe that yeah that's perfect already fantastic but let me reclaim i'm simply blending all this place into each other so it doesn't look funny at the end of the day after that now first of all what is a smoky eye look a smoky eye is one where you apply a really heavy intense shade on your um eyeshadow space and that eyeshadow space consists of your crease your total crease what am i calling the crease when you open your eyes like this your eye tends to crease in this space so it means all this space is what we call your crease section so i'm going to be putting an intensely dark color there this is to say i can use black and it doesn't have to always be black it can be something else it can be um it can be something else entirely it can be like um yeah like 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 a wine but there will be a dark inside and then the wine will just blend into it it's not done with two colors like the way we separate colors you know when you have the color one two three no not like that like this now if i want to make this wine i simply on top of my dark base i simply add my wine into it now there are several ways to create this particular look i love that person putting all those likes put my likes there press the like button press the like button press the love button i want to see all of them right now okay now let me go into this explanation very carefully the way it works is you can use several methods to achieve it but the best method i like i always usually go to my go-to method is i like to use a the this one what do they call this one eyebrow gel okay it's dark it's intense when you place it there it, it quickly sits properly for you the reason why i 